This is Go Math Lesson 4.1 for third grade, and today we're going to multiply with 2 and 4. So on the top part it says write a multiplication sentence for the for the model. All right, so we're going to look at number 1 here, which they've already done, and it says there are two groups of, as, well, it shows you a picture of two groups, and in each of those two groups there's five, one, two, three, four, five counters in each group. So um, the number they placed here first is the number of groups. So it's one, two, and the number five is how many are contained in each one of those groups, which is five. So two times five is 10. I could also count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, or I could count by fives, five, ten, to figure that out. So that's how you figure out those. I'm gonna just do a couple problems below that. You'll do number one, uh, number two the same way that's shown on number one. Um, but I don't want to go ahead and do that because that's the only one left. So let's go ahead and look at these. Find the product, which means find the answer uh, for the two fact multiplying the two factors. So well, let's do number four. It says eight times four times eight. Um, now, if you're still not uh, familiar with all your multiplication tables and you're still working on that, one way to do that is just to draw pictures. Continue to draw pictures to help you understand and memorize. So I'm going to draw four groups. And we draw eight in each group. Now I will say, if you already know your multiplication tables, you can go ahead and just answer it. Uh, you're probably not looking at this video if you already know your multiplication tables. So, so I have eight in each group here. Now I could do this a number of ways. I could count each and every single one of them, which I'm not gonna do, but that is one strategy you can do. Um, you can also just write the numbers out over here. So I have eight plus eight, and that equals what? Six, eight plus eight is 16. Okay, again, I could count all the uh, counters in there, um, or if I have my addition skills, I can just add. Um, I know this is another 16, because this is the same as the ones below, above it. So I'm going to add 16 plus 16. 6 and 6 makes 12. I regroup the 10. 1, 2, 3, and that is 32. So 8 times 4 equals 32. So on these problems as you go along, um, don't be afraid to draw pictures if that's what helps you do it, because um, that will help you understand how multiplication works uh, until you're able to uh, memorize those mem uh, multiplication facts. And that is how we multiply with 2 and 4.